Tony Dungy is a Hall of Fame coach. Kevin Warren is the commissioner of the Big Ten. I had a chance this past weekend to moderate a discussion with them for a small audience, a discussion that turned into thoughts on race in the Twin Cities. Super Bowl champion coach Tony Dungy and Big Ten Commissioner Kevin Warren were in town for Tony's annual weekend committed to his initiative, Uncommon. At a private meeting, the topic turned to the civil unrest in the Twin Cities, a place both have called home. I can't look at everything through my own experience only. Uh, that's an easy way to say everybody else is wrong and I'm right. What they also know is that on a national scale, there is a new perception in regards to the Twin Cities. People who don't know the Twin Cities, who haven't lived here, who don't come here, you know, look at the Twin Cities now as a place that's in a crisis mode. And I think people need to recognize that. Dungey believes because of what he's seen. Growing up near Detroit and 12 years old when Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated. Dr. King and Robert Kennedy in the 68 Olympics and are we ever going to get through this and our streets were burning all over the country. And, and we got through it, and we came through it, and we will get through this, but it's going to take effort. What they both believe is that it cannot be solved with money or government, but has to be genuine and organic. And there are a lot of people in society think that if you throw money at a problem, you can solve it. And if you throw more money at a problem, you can solve it even faster. I think it's just the opposite. And they agree the process will not end this week. It's another step. This will be a multi-generational fix, yes. but we can do it. We deserve to do it. We owe it to our next generation. But what is hard to digest is what they've seen from afar in a place very dear to both of them. Mike, I'll tell you, being on the outside looking in, it, it does not look like the Twin Cities that, that I knew. Two class acts. Warren commutes from here in Chicago. Dungey runs his branded Uncommon Initiative and lives in the Tampa area.